Hey folks, thanks so much for checking out your Friday night weather update. Ben Luna coming to you. Tonight's update is brought to you as a service of our friends at First National Bank. As we head through the rest of this evening, skies will remain clear. It's going to be a pleasant night with a nice breeze from the north between 3 and 5, but it's going to be a mild overnight. Look to start Saturday morning off with clear skies around 70 degrees, but I'm going to leave in just a small chance for a few remaining scattered storms. Now, we did have a couple of severe thunderstorm warnings earlier this evening for folks in Murray County. A good little downpour formed uh, between Columbia, the interstate, and down into Mount Pleasant, and that cell just lettered, well, literally set in uh, southern Murray County for about two or three hours this evening and prompted a, a couple of warnings. No damage reports, but quite a bit of rain uh, fell in that part of the world this evening. Therefore, just a smidgen rain chance left, uh, but 99% of you will be clear overnight. Now, as we head uh, into the next seven days, we've got a few rain chances to talk about and some really warm temperatures as well. I'll uh, dive into that seven day next. Again, brought to you tonight by our friends at First National Bank. This community needs a partner, and we're your community bank, First National Bank. Here we value relationships, our local heritage, community involvement, teamwork, and random acts of kindness. At First National, we live by our responsibility to serve this community. And with you by our side, we're making our community even better. First National Bank, making communities great. And here's your First National Bank Friday night, seven-day forecast. Your weekend looking pretty good. Saturday, again, mostly dry, plenty of sunshine, but I'm going to leave in a small chance for a few of those afternoon downpours uh, as we head through the heat of the afternoon. Now, speaking of heat, it's going to be a scorching weekend with plenty of sunshine across the area. Look for daytime highs to climb to the low to mid-90s on average. Now, factoring in that humidity, it's going to feel like about 100 degrees, and if you're inside a uh, city area, uh, with a lot of paved services, the yeah, the actual temperature close to you could actually exceed 100. So make sure you take frequent breaks and drink plenty of fluids if you're going to be out and about through the coming weekend. Again, a few spotty storms here as we head through Sunday afternoon. Rain chances up just a smidge because of some more moisture that's going to be pulled into the area. Uh, forecast models trying to set the stage for another Bermuda high to take effect, and that's going to be pulling in that Gulf moisture into next week, and that's going to fuel a few more of those heat of the day storms. Otherwise, and for the most part, really no major changes inside for our weather. We're going to stay in the upper 80s to the low 90s here for the next several days. Mild overnights as well 69 to 70 degrees here for the foreseeable future uh, without a doubt it is summertime in the Tennessee Valley region but get out and enjoy the weather uh, when it's nice if you can but uh, make sure you stay hydrated and uh, take frequent break, uh, breaks and uh, apply that sunblock because uh, the uh, areas that do see plenty of sunshine it's going to get warm real quick all right, that is your seven day on your Friday night. We'll uh, update the forecast again as we move through the weekend. Until then, have a blessed evening, and we'll talk to you again soon.